Get your free copy of the complete tutorial at www.teachucomp.com forward slash free. You can set up subtotal items in the item list. A subtotal will total all of the items in the invoice up to the last subtotal entered if there was one entered. This can be handy for totaling all of the previous line items within an invoice before applying a discount to the subtotaled amount. You create subtotal items by first opening the item list. To then create a new item, click the item button in the lower left corner and then select the new command. In the new item window that appears, you can then select subtotal from the type dropdown. In the new item window, you then enter a name for the subtotal into the item name slash number box. You can then enter a description of the subtotal to display within invoices and sales receipts into the description field. Once you've created the subtotal item, you simply click the OK button to save the item into the item list. Like what you see? Pick up your free copy of the complete tutorial at www.teachucomp.com forward slash free.